I am so pissed off now! Close. Hey! Huh? Huh, Dad! Uh, what? What in the world are you wearing? Uh, what the? The Supreme Kai? Uh, and that old timer? Wait, didn't he die? Uh, Dad? What are you doing here? About that. I see. So Majin Buu's already caused that much damage. So, that's the legendary sword you were talking about, I take it. That thing looks crazy sharp! You said it's the Z sword? Indeed. Let's test it out with some catch and tight. The hardest metal in the universe. Haha! <laughs> I bet this thing will cut through that stuff like a hot knife through butter! It's a legendary sword, right? Here goes! Yeah! No... no way! It broke! This can't be! The, the Z sword! It. But it's. the ultimate sword! Well, Supreme Kai, you're the one who wanted to test it out on the hardest stuff around. But. but it was supposed to give its wielder the strongest power in the universe! <laughs> that shows how little you know, doesn't it? Huh? Wait, who's the old guy? Who are you calling an old guy? I'm the Supreme Kai from 15 generations before you! <laughs> 15 generations before me? The... the Supreme Kai? Many ages ago, a truly evil individual feared my special ability so much that he sealed me in that sword that you just broke. He doesn't look like he's got any special abilities. Just looks like an old geezer to me. Uh, yeah. Well, I never. I guess I won't tell you what my special ability is then. What? Come on! I, I was just kidding! <laughs> I'm still not telling you. I'll get a real woman to kiss you if you promise to tell us. Doesn't that sound nice? Are you serious? You're not pulling my leg? Yeah, I'm totally serious. I knew it. He's the same type as Master Roshi. So then, would this power of yours be enough to defeat Majin Buu? Well, I can't say for certain, but yes, it should be. Listen up, Gohan. I can't go back to Earth anymore. I need you to get Bulma up to speed and ask her to cooperate. Uh... Wait... You want me to ask Bulma that? Look, we're saving the whole universe here. It's a good deal if you ask me. Huh, even if we do save the universe, Bulma's gonna kill us. Okay, wait. What kind of abilities are we talking about here? Right then. As for my special ability, I can release one's true power and raise it beyond its limits. <laughs> Never heard of an ability like that, have you? What? Seriously? That sounds like a pretty common ability, actually. Ah, how dare you! I said beyond one's limits! Far beyond! You there! You're the one who pulled the sword out, yes? Come here! Right then. Now just stand there and don't move a muscle. Uh, okay. And here we go! For the destruction of Majin Buu! <laughs> <laughs> hey! Hey! Ahem! 
Go! Go! <laughs> Yay! Yay! Um, how long is this gonna take? The ritual takes five hours, but the power increase takes 20. Huh? Uh, I'm gonna take a nap then. Hang in there, Gohan. Oh, man. A day was about to elapse since training began. Very good, you two. You've more or less perfected it. Think it might be time to see if you can actually pull it off. All right. First, match each other's energy. Uh, okay. Good. Now begin. did it at least this time. In at least 30 minutes, we'll have you try it again as Super Saiyans. <laughs> Don't you think you're underestimating me? I've got what it takes to beat Majin Buu right now. You don't know the first thing about how strong Majin Buu is. There's absolutely no way you can beat him. Not just yet, anyway! So can we trust a little punk like this? In just one single day, the feared Majin Buu easily laid waste to roughly 80% of the planet's population. After turning some of his victims into clay, he constructed a house to come back to after his daily destruction. The people of Earth continued their fight for survival against the Majin menace and deployed their military forces. But that ultimately proved futile, with each force being completely decimated. Soon thereafter, Humanity stopped trying, but hope was not completely lost among those remaining. They knew their savior was still alive somewhere and ready to spring into action. The man who overpowered Cell and became the world's, no, the universe's greatest warrior. That savior is none other than the legendary undefeated warrior, world martial arts champion, Mr. Satan. So that's Majin Buu's house, huh? Well, uh, I wonder if he's home. Uh, I hope he isn't. Oh, oh he's not here. <laughs> oh, what's the matter, Mozzie Boo? You chicken? Well, uh, that's that then. Uh, he's not here, uh, so I can't fight him. Uh, time to head back now. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Hello, uh, it's a pleasure to meet you. Hmm, why'd they turn you into this time? Wait, wait, wait a second, uh, Mr. Mazian Boo. You see, I've come to see if there's anything I can do for you. <laughs> you want to be Boo's servant? Uh, yeah, of course I do. 
<laughs> I've actually uh, uh, brought you a present, Mr. Muzzy Boo. Here, it's some premium chocolate. <laughs> Take it. Chocolate! What? It means it's very expensive and super delicious. Hmm? Please work. Pound! <laughs> he ate it. He actually ate it. <laughs> what an idiot. I put enough poison in that chocolate to kill an elephant. So I'm gonna pound you into big putty for this. And so began a strange friendship between Majin Buu and Mr. Satan, with Mr. Satan working tirelessly to keep Majin Buu's mood under control. Several days later, well, welcome back. I'm still in the middle of preparing our meal. Hey, uh, wh what's that dog doing here? This guy no scared of boo. He no run away. Boo no understand what he say. Do you know what he say? Oh, uh, well, I don't speak dog, but it looks like his leg's in real bad shape. That's why he didn't run away. Huh? Really? Well, okay. Who heal you now? Then get scared and run away! Uh. Now run away! Uh. Huh? Why he no run away? Who heal him? <laughs> well, look at that. He's just happy that you made him feel better. I think he likes you now, Mr. Boo. Like Boo? He like Boo? That's right. He likes you. Hmm? He like you? You like Boo? Huh? Well, uh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Boo kind of happy. Well, uh, he, he, he actually does seem happy. Um, uh, <laughs> Mr. Boo, sir, uh, may I ask you something? Well, uh, why are you uh, killing people and, uh, and destroying their homes? Because Bibbity and Bobbity told Boo to do that! And, uh, who are they again? You know there, uh, Boo, uh, you shouldn't listen to bad guys like them. Y you see, uh, it's not good to, to kill people and break things. You think Boo should not do that? Well, uh, yeah, but, uh, yes. Okay, Boo, stop! Huh? You, uh, won't kill people anymore? Yeah. And no more destruction? I did it! I actually did it! I really am a hero, aren't I? This is it, boss! This has got to be Ma Majin Boo's house! What the hell are you shaking for? I told you, this is gonna be a piece of cake. After all, we've killed a whole bunch of people. What's one more? Well, yeah, but this guy's a margin. Listen up. Boo's killed so many people around the world that people will think anyone we've killed was killed by him. Let's do this!
Why do you think Mr. Satan is hanging out with Martin Boo like that? <laughs> Who gives a crap? We'll just kill them both. Then we'll be the heroes. <laughs> Mr. Stason! Damn it! We missed Boo! Unable to be contained any longer, the evil within Majin Buu came bellowing out and formed into another Majin Buu. The one singular Majin Buu now stood divided, split between his innocent side and his evil side. Rendered weaker from the split, the original Majin Buu stood no chance against his evil counterpart and was ultimately absorbed by him. He still remembers me! While Goten and Trunks entered the final stages of their fusion training, Piccolo and Dende kept a watchful eye over Majin Buu and Mr. Satan. Unbelievable! Hey, uh, what's going on, Piccolo? Don't you feel the change in Majin Buu's energy? Huh? That monster's changed, and it's all because of that brain-dead Earthling. Now Boo's pure evil, not to mention even stronger than before. <gasps> no, we aren't safe here. Majin Boo now has the power to sense our energies.
Show me! Huh? Show me! Uh, show you? Uh, what do you want us to show you? Show me the guy to fight! You promised me a fight! He must be here. I could feel a very large power. Uh, we do have people here to fight you, but they're sleeping right now. They're gearing up for their fight with you. Wake them up! I hate waiting! <sighs> Damn it. We're out of options. We have to sacrifice the remaining survivors and wish them back with the Dragon Balls. It's the only way we can stall Majin Buu. Th that's right! You did say you were going to kill everyone on Earth, right? There are still plenty of people left to kill. Take care of them first, then you can fight. Hmm. Killed everyone on Earth. Now I can fight. Show me the guys to fight. Fine, I'll show you. But you're going to have to wait. They've been sleeping, and they need to get ready. No. Mr. Satan's daughter here wants you to wait as well. <laughs> <sighs> Really? You're right. She smells like Satan. Okay, I'll wait. But only a little. Go wake up Trunks and Goten and get them into the hyperbolic time chamber. Now! It might not be much, but they could still get a few days of training in. Uh, right. Piccolo was able to buy Goten and Trunks time to train, but Majin Buu's patience was finally wearing thin. Piccolo had no choice but to escort the irritated Majin Buu to the hyperbolic time chamber. Here it is. You took a long time getting here! Hopefully I stalled him long enough. One minute out here is six hours in there. They should have been able to get a week's training done. Hopefully. Ta-da! Boom! We've been, been waiting, waiting for ya! Imagine, Bill! Hmm. Is that them? Yes! Please, let this work. Right now, we need a miracle. Let's do it! Okay! Fusion! After fusing, I'm gonna try this nice and quick. I wonder what cool move I should use first. Now, is it my turn to attack? Now. 
You got any more powerful attacks? <laughs> you bet I do. You just wait. But I kind of want to scare Piccolo a bit. That'd be more exciting. I it's no use. I, I don't have enough energy to pull off any more of my awesome moves. It's all over now. This world is as good as gone. <laughs> what? It's the end of the line for you, Majin Boo. Because I just completely destroyed the only thing connecting this place to the world outside of it. All of us are now trapped in here for the rest of our lives. What? <clears throat> The only thing you can do is kill us and spend an eternity all by yourself in this vast and empty space. Why? What about my favorite sweets? No sweets here. None. What gives, Piccolo? Why didn't you tell me you were going to do that? I was planning on using my super awesome move and stuff. Hey! You said you didn't have any of your power left! I was acting, you know, to make things a little more dramatic. Idiot! Why make things more dramatic at a time like this? Hurry up and fix the entrance, you stupid green party pooper! I can't fix it, you cocky little spoiled brat! I hate... Piccolo, huh? what's that? Uh, I don't believe it. How did he... Uh, he used his massive energy to rip a hole between dimensions. <laughs> no! It's gone! What, what was that noise just now? Lucky! Oh. Majin Blue! This is perfect! I was just getting hungry! What should I turn you into? I know chocolate! It's no use. We can't even open a tiny hole. <laughs> well, I guess I'm gonna have to use it after all. What, what do you mean? 
<laughs> Take a guess. Ta-da! Hey, what are you? When? How? What did you just do? Beats the hell out of me. But I do know I'm super duper strong now. Anyway, we got more important things to do now, right? Tell me what you did to everyone here, right now! <laughs> They're here. Hmm? You, you, you ate them? Turned them into chocolate! I am so pissed off now! Yeah! yeah! Here comes the pain! You're just waiting for munching on my people! Time, you know. You're gonna have to wait an hour to see this awesome hair again. Uh, uh, huh. Interesting. He's getting weaker. Maybe not physically, but mentally, he's suffering. <laughs> Say goodbye! You are not gonna be able to come back after this! I'm gonna vaporize every last bit of you! What? Meanwhile, in the land of the Kais, Gohan continued to undergo the ritual to unleash even more of his latent power. Goku and the others kept their eyes glued to Elder Kai's crystal ball as they followed Gotenk's battle with Majin Buu. Uh, no way! They're back to normal now! Hey! Can you pick up the pace, Gramps? I don't know about you, but the kids are running out of power over here. Are you serious, Dad? Yeah, at this rate, they're goners. All right, off you go. 
I actually finished about five minutes ago. <sighs> You're finished? Five minutes? <sighs> Why didn't you tell me sooner? You fool! Sending you off when the situation is dire is much more dramatic. Oh no, I'd better hurry or I'm not gonna make it. Okay, so how am I supposed to become this ultimate warrior? What do you mean? You turn into that super whatever all the time. It's like that. Just fire yourself up and you'll see. It's like turning into a super saiyan, huh? Uh, okay. Yeah! <laughs> This is incredible. Do you see this, Dad? What? Yeah. It really is incredible. To Earth, before things go so far that they can't be undone. Allow me to send our new hero to his destination. Sorry I can't join you, Gohan. I wish I could. I gotta stay here. I wish for a lot of things. I wish I could have seen you grow up. Dad. This is probably the last time I'll see you, Gohan. At least until you die. Good luck, son. Show Majin Buu what you can do. I will. I'll take my leave now. We're counting on you. Right. Uh, I've got a small request, Kibito. Could I ask for a change of clothes? I'd like an outfit just like my dad's. I want to honor him when I fight. Hmm, yes, I see. Consider it done. Well, let me see. It was the color of the excrement produced by the frogs on Popol, yes? Um, it's orange, actually. This is perfect! Thank you, thank you very much. I'm going now. We will be praying for your success as we watch from the land of the Kais. Goodbye. Give my regards to the others. Don't worry, I've got this. All right, time to go.